fish the private store. fish store literally begins a little like plastic lobster as you can see wait why is it moving? Look, oh, he's so cute. That's like the only fish in here. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, he's not the only fish. What? The, there's a shark. What's up, Raw fam? So we're over here at Aqua Tropics. My great buddy, Jesse, I actually just had an awesome conversation with him. He actually let me schedule an appointment for a private tour of his fish store. Let's get in there, and I'm gonna show you guys literally the coolest fish store in Gainesville, Florida. Let's get in there. Here we go, guys. We're going in right now. Hey, hey what's up, man? Guys? Come on, guys. What's up, Raw fam? Are you Raw? Yeah, Raw. Hey, yeah. Jesse, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, buddy. So hey. this is the guy I was talking to you guys. You know, Aqua Tropics, we're over here, and oh my gosh. Guys, look, look, let's just turn the camera right here. Oh my gosh. These things are so good. Look at this, guys. Look, is that a tarpon? Look at the tarpon. Correct. Look, he's like an Indonesian freshwater tarpon. An Indonesian, look at this, guys. Look, look, he's like looking at me. Look at him, come, come right here. Come on an angle. Are they like excited? They're like, the raw fam is here. They know, oh, is he gonna like eat? Do you have any food for Absolutely. him? Absolutely. Oh my gosh, the private right. fish store literally begins with a pig nose, AKA this is a fly river, correct? Correct. Fly oh river, my, turtle, a fly river. river. This is so here. cool. And you know, this guy is about to eat. We're, we're literally starting this fish store off. This is like the best way you could start it. A fish feeding within 30 seconds of the video. So, hi buddy. Hi, can I have a kiss? <laughs> so here we go. We're getting some food right now. And whenever he gets the food, I'll, I'll get back to you guys. Guys, time for breakfast. Oh guys, look. We got breakfast time. Looks like they know too. Hey. Hey guys. They absolutely know. Oh, and they don't play. Oh my god, look at the tarpon. Look at the tarpon. Oh, 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 get the pig nose, get the pig and nose. The pig nose, what he wants is this. Oh, like a banana or something? Oh no, oh, he wants his, oh, oh. his veggie wafers. Veggie wafers, get him. Get him, veggies. He knows too. Oh yeah, so now with the, with the, the pig nose, we like to feed him out of the cup. Uh huh. Right here, if at all possible. There you go. Just to try to get him. Oh, Watch the tarpon. Out, guys. The oh, yeah, tarpon. they don't play. Oh, the tarpon. Oh, Baby my guy. gosh. This thing is so sick. Right he, he's easy trained to eat out of a cup? He is normally, yes, if I can keep it in the cup, that is. But uh, he'll usually eat it out of your hands. However, everybody's getting a little too overly excited. So oh, we'll my just... gosh. He's eating. Oh, yes. Oh my god, that is so, that is right up Blake's alley. Oh my gosh. And look, look at the tarpon, guys. Look at the gorgeous Indo-Pacific, Indo-Pacific, right? Correct. Indo-Pacific tarpon, guys. Look how gorgeous that little guy is. Well, fam, guys, did we not pick a absolute amazing place here over in Gainesville, Florida? Guys, the address will actually be in the description of the video if you guys want to go check this place out. But I'm going to give you guys a private tour starting now. So this is the first beautiful tank. Look at these guys. Can we get a thumbnail? <laughs> but guys, we're having an awesome time over here. And guys, how this place is already amazing. Look at this little guy. He's literally eating. Look, look, look. Right here, he's literally eating. Oh my god, look, he's eating the dirt. Oh my god, he's eating the, the gravel in there. He's like searching. He's, he's good at sifting through. Oh Luckily, that gosh. substrate is small enough for him to pass in the case yeah, that he does ever sure, swallow. Yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Well, what is that? Flagtail Procleotis from South America as well. You know your stuff, Jesse. I try. Up top. <laughs> Up top for sure. So look at that. Oh my god, look at the tarpon. Look at literally all of the tarpon. This is literally so cool. This is my dream tank right here. I just have a question. What is that weird thing back there? The Which black one? one? Oh, that's a Paratilopia bleakeri, one of a handful of species of cichlid from Madagascar. And if you guys didn't know what that was, that was a Paratilopia bleakeri. is their common name. If you guys, you know, want them to get one of these fish in for you, give them a phone call, drive down, pick up your fish, and you guys can get, you know, something awesome like this. So, guys, this is just the first tank, guys. They literally have koi ponds behind you. Look at this, Raw fam. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Hi, babies. Hello. Anyone want to give me kisses? No, no, no. They don't like kisses. They don't like kisses. That so that's literally already our first fish feeding. We're going to get over here and, you know, see some more epic fish. Here, we don't let anything go to waste. Let's see if they'll take it. And if he doesn't... Oh my <laughs> God. All right, so is this, there's more stuff over here? Absolutely, if you think that was cool, wait till you see what we have down here. Really? Absolutely. Oh my Check gosh, that was, that was pretty cool. Oh my God, guys, are these, are those albino pakus? Correct. Oh my goodness, guys, this is so freaking cool. As you guys can see, I mean, those are absolutely gorgeous. Are you ready? Let's see if, let's see if they're hungry today. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. And knowing the popular, I knew that they were going to just start going crazy. Get him, get him. Throw it in there. Throw it in there. Whoa. <laughs> Guys, how cool is this, Raw Fam? How cool is this? Guys, look how freaking cool this is, guys. These are albino pakus. These guys are a hundred dollars a piece for one of these big guys, and this guy right here is fifty dollars. So, um, yeah, you can see like how diverse you know the pricing ranges over here. Um, look at these guys. Do these guys eat too? Um, yeah, absolutely. These Let guys are so food cool. For them as well. Perfect. So we're gonna get some food for these guys. Look at the, how weird this little guy is. Look at his big old lips. Hi, buddy. How you do? Look how cool that is. All oh, right, guys. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. They're crazier than the Paku. Oh, look yeah. at them. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Look, 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 look. Look how cool they are. Look how freaking cool. So wait, is this like a baby Paku right here? As like, this one's like a lot smaller than like, than these guys. So like, that's obviously like, like a couple like, weeks or months younger than those guys? Surprisingly, actually, these two are actually the same exact age. What? Uh, the difference is that these guys originally here grew up in a much, much larger aquarium. So you guys said you guys had like salt water here too? Right That's so... Way. What the heck? These, are this is salt water or no? Uh, no sir, those are this glow tetras. Glow tetras, what? They are literally glowing fish, guys. Are you sure you didn't take like some like radioactive juice and just pour it in there when you did your water changes? Not quite, not quite. The people who created them actually genetically modified these fish. With what? what jellyfish the? DNA. So if they take je jellyfish DNA, I will glow? Not necessarily. Uh, maybe if they injected it during while you were developing. Uh, however, as an adult, probably not so much. So it's possible what you're saying? It's possible. It's definitely possible. I hate to say anything's impossible. There you go. So these little guys are so freaking cool. We're going to get over it. I'm going to show you guys literally the sickest saltwater tanks out there. He already told me that they have grouper, sharks, you name it, they got it. Cool freaking stuff. Anemones and... Let's get over there. So as you guys can see, like this is a, um, this is a tank for coral and then they have like these little fake um you can see like there's like a fake um uh, little like plastic lobster as you can see wait why is it moving bro why is the lobster moving oh it's because he's not plastic what yep that is a living critter what what yep fire cleaner shrimp what can you what you're lying. You, no, there's no way. Prove it. Oh, there's absolutely. No, there's no way. Absolutely. That's a living animal? Oh, absolutely. What? And as you can see, they get their name Cleaner Shrimp because from time to time they'll come up and decide to clean you. And these are their cousins here, the Skunk Cleaners. Oh my gosh, it literally looks like a fake shrimp. He's, he's biting you. Bro, he's biting you. Oh no, he's gentle. Oh my god, that's so gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Oh my, oh my gosh. It, uh, please tell me this is fresh water. Uh, no, this is oh salt water. Oh my gosh, I would buy one. I would buy all of them. Oh my, can I have them do that to my hand? Like this Absolutely. is my hand. Go right ahead. This is my hand going in. Nice, nice oh. all natural pedicure. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at them. Oh, they're attacking. They're attacking. <laughs> Raw fam, look at this. As my girlfriend picks up the camera. Look at this, guys. Oh, and they are literally all over my hand. Oh, I'm getting swarmed by fake shrimp. They do not look real. There's no way this is real life right now. Look at them all. Can you zoom in? Zoom in on that guy right there. Oh my God. Oh my Jesus. This is so awesome. Look at that little guy. Oh my goodness. Do you guys see that little guy? You wanna, wanna look at him on top of the water here? Come here. Guys. Look at him floating around. Look, he's gonna scoot backwards in a little second when I open him up and send him back to his little home. Look at him. So this little guy will actually clean my hands. And there he goes. Welcome back to your home. Oh, look at this little guy. Hi, look at him, babe. How you doing, Ralph fam? Guys, how cool was that? So. You guys have anything else that's cool, like fake shrimp? Look over there, look over there. Um, I've got this guy here, same tank. Oh, Really unique critter. This back is up, a back uh, up, bro. Back peacock up, back up, back. mantis shrimp. Bro, that thing literally looks like he's about to attack me. Oh yes, that right there is actually one of the hardest hitting animals in the world. Hardest hit, like, no, no, that doesn't, guys, obviously, you know, like a ram. Like, you know, like a ram, like, 
with their head, like that's the hardest hitting, right? So, I mean, that thing's pretty cool, but you know, I would imagine that, you know, like a ram, like, like a big ram would be able to hit harder than that. I, I... Not quite. No, he is definitely a harder hitting critter. Oh, what? Absolutely. That... Being, being whacked by this shrimp here would be uh, similar to being shot by a 22 caliber bullet. This fish can shoot, like, okay, so if this fish attacks you, it's basically like getting shot by a bullet. Oh, yes. That's the coolest thing I've ever, and, but yet again, everything cools in salt water, guys. Not necessarily, because, bro, we just saw some epic, epic stuff. So, I mean, if this is what you guys have so far for the salt water version, Woo, I can't wait to get to the grouper you said. Absolutely, we've got a few of those as well. They have a grouper, guys. So let's get over here and let me show you guys. Oh my good. <laughs> here we got a few eels. A few? That's yeah, so just cool. a few. These are uh, moray eels, various kinds. We have gold head morays like him there, a little small gold head there, and a couple of snowflakes. Ooh, they as look well. like snakes. Can they bite you? Oh, yes, and how. <laughs> can they, they can take your finger off? At this size, I wouldn't say that, but he definitely could. What the heck is that thing? Back up, back up, back up. Can he, like, attack us? Ah, oh, not through there. That's why we got the big rocks up there. What the heck is that thing? That is a green moray. A green moray eel, guys. Correct. And he's, uh, he's kind of the unspoken store mascot so here. This You could actually find this in Florida, correct? Correct. Down in the Keys in the Bahamas. Oh, my. Guys, he read my mind, guys. So I was over at the Bahamas the other day, and I was swimming, and I put my head in a hole. Because I went over there, you know, we were looking for big grouper and lobster and all this cool stuff. And I put my head right in the hole and I go, what the heck is that? There was an amore eel head like this big looking at me. And I was like, I'm done. I'm getting out of here. It was like this big. It was so awesome. And this guy is freaking big. How big could these guys get? Um, In the wild, I've heard stories of potentially 8 to 10 feet. Exactly my point. And the, the one I saw was, you know like this big so eight to ten feet is obviously a lot bigger almost double triple that size so this guy's so cool oh this is such a cool coral tank guys look it has like living coral and stuff like that and like like look at the little fish right there and like look oh he's so cute that's like the only fish in here oh he's so cute oh he's not the only fish no i don't see any oh what the heck is it back up back what the, there's a shark there's literally a shark what the heck, bro? You should have warned me. You could have jumped out. <laughs> yep, that is a uh, banded cat shark. What the heck? Is it a cat because you could take it for walks? Not quite. No, no. I'm not can, sure where they get the name Can cat you shark touch from. it? You can touch him. He's actually one of the more peaceful sharks. So, like, is this your little buddy? Yeah, this is Blue because he's my boy. Aww. <laughs> he's being a little camera shy this morning. Hey, Rolfam, everyone say hi, Blue. <laughs> this is so cool, though. Look at this little guy. Look right here. Look right there. Zoom in on him. What's, what type of shark is he? Banded cat shark. So he's a banded Ocean. cat shark. And if you guys look in here, it's Nemo, everyone. I know the little kitties are gonna say, hi Nemo, look at Nemo. He's right there. What's up Nemo? Let's pop up here all fam. Guys, so how cool is this, guys? We're over here at Aquatropics. We're over here at Aquatropics, guys. And you know, this place, it... I just turn my head and every way I turn, you know, I just have to close my eyes at this point because there's so many viral videos here that, you know, you guys are probably just seeing stuff you guys have never seen before. This is a saltwater grouper and this thing is insane. Look at this little guy. Hi, buddy. Can I pet you? Absolutely. Aw. Look, guys, look, look right here. He's kind of our garbage disposal here in the store. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Hi, buddy. <laughs> that is so sick. And you know what he actually kind of looks like? A strawberry grouper. If you guys are familiar with the Florida Keys, we have a lot of strawberry groupers over there. And this guy, because of the polka dots, kind of resembles that. Hi, buddy. Is it a strawberry? Uh, no. I'm actually not certain what species that is. A, uh, a customer had him for years and sadly got too old to take care of him, so he brought him to us. So we have sharks, as you guys can see. We have amore eels. We have... Finding Nemo all in literally one corner of this store and you know this place is so freaking cool guys I encourage you guys to come over here to this local fish store. They've been here for 40 plus years It was an amazing aquarium basically an aquarium encounter This was an amazing awesome video if you guys are enjoying the video to this point guys Leave a like and don't forget to subscribe to today's awesome adventure. I love you all fam and I was gonna do the outro, but hey, man
Thank you so much, You're guys. This welcome. is Jesse. Hey. This is Jesse over here at Aquatropics. Aquatropics. Don't forget it. I love you all, fam, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.